Good morning, friends of Jesus. This is our class for March 13th. Today's gospel tells us that those who believe and follow Jesus will have eternal life. As we enter the fourth week of Lent, we are reminded that we are brought into relationship with God because God loves us. We must respond to his love by putting our faith into action. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Wondrous God, you want us to believe in your unending love for us. Help us when our faith is shaky to cling to Jesus' teachings. Help us see and hear you in all the good around us. Through Christ our Lord, amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. For God so loved the world that he gave his only Son, so that everyone who believes in him may not perish but have eternal life. Indeed, God did not send the Son into the world to condemn the world, but in order that the world might be saved through him. Those who believe in him are not condemned, and this is the judgment that the light has come into the world, and people love darkness rather than light because their deeds were evil. For all who do evil hate the light and do not come to the light, so that their deeds may not be exposed. But those who do what is true come to the light, so that it may be seen clearly that their deeds have been done in God. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. The saint of the day is St. Patrick, since we are so close to St. Patrick's feast day. And um, take some time right now to pause and look at the iPad lesson. The iPad lesson actually goes through John 3.16 and talks a little bit more about um, that particular verse. And our craft also goes through and talks a little bit more about John 3.16. So you have, um, this does show that you're putting handprints with paint, um, but we are not doing that today. We're just going to put our cross on our paper. So you're going to want to take the heart and you're going to want to put it on your white cross. You're going to take the back off the cross and you're going to want to, on your blue, put it right in the middle of the blue, just like that. Then we have the John 316 verse that we heard in the gospel. And that's going to go right here on the bottom. just like so. And then with someone's help, you're going to put a knots in this so that um, you can hang this up either at your, on your door, um, on the refrigerator, or somewhere in your room. It should hang like this. So with whoever is with you, go around the room and say who you would like to pray for today. I would like to pray for anyone who's going on spring break these next couple weeks, um, that they have safe travels and they remain healthy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Thank you and have a nice week.